Suicide may not be openly discussed, and those helping people through their struggles may be struggling themselves. Cami Clark explains how mental health professionals feel the pain of their patients' suicides. Suicide can affect those closest to the person lost, but mental health professionals are also impacted by the suicide of their patients. Psychologist Lisa Fisher explains the emotional toll that those in her field may experience. They become very guilt and feel very ashamed and they feel alone, not comfortable to talk about it. As mental health professionals feel the effects of their patient's suicide, psychiatrist Brian Espinoza explains how he checks on colleagues who may be struggling. Well, I do have a couple of physicians that I'm kind of concerned about, and occasionally I'll, I'll reach out to them, whether it's in the hallway, in the hospital, or give them a text, and just let them remind them that you know, I'm always available to, to talk with. According to the Center of Violence Prevention and Community Safety at Arizona State University, in 2016, about 56% of people who died by suicide in Arizona had at least one mental health problem. Impact Suicide Prevention Crisis Call Center Manager Dennis Therian says professionals who provide help also go through the grieving process. If there's not that awareness and people think because of maybe their status or professional position, it, they're not affected in the same way, they never get the help that they need and they're exposed to it more than most. Uh, so it's really important to acknowledge that so that opens the possibility to getting that help. While psychologists and other mental health care professionals feel the effects of suicide, psychologist Lisa Fisher has a support group where others can come and cope. Our job is to take care of other people. But we tend to forget to take care of ourselves. So when something very traumatic like your dad happened, we need to take care of ourselves as well. Regardless of your profession, Fisher says it's important to communicate your feelings and to reach out for help. In Phoenix, Cami Clark, Cronkite News.